Hey guys, I'm Simitos Ken, and welcome back to To the Moon. Last episode, we tried to get the memory to take, and it, it's pretty much being rejected. Like, everything they tried, they cannot get this guy to go to the moon in his mind. And so they've waited till morning, and they're trying to figure it out. Ah, oh, you can smell that squirrel Neil ran over all the way from here now. Okay. I'm supposed to try to figure out Four River. What kind of a song is this? It's just two notes repeated over and over. Really? Yeah, it really is. I wonder if I'm supposed to explore the house some more. The kitchen? Just to take a peek in the kitchen, see if anything happens. Ah, uh, no, I understand that part, but okay. Did you confirm? Did you confirm it in his records? And why again was this information not made available to us? Or the medical doctor for that matter? Where'd you get that coffee? Shh! Are you speaking with headquarter? Yes, I'll fill you in after. Now shh! Wait, isn't this... Where did you find it? In the lighthouse before we started. Now for the last time, shh. It's the last paper I haven't given to John. Right, that part we can do. Sit. Okay. Hmm. Let's go down the basement then. I wonder like, if, you, if they unfold the rabbit so there's like something written in it or something. But Ma, I don't want to go to school. It's Sunday, dear. <laughs> Shh, let them sleep. There's painting. He said he hated painting, but he has the canvas. Let's see. Place book on shelf. The Pilgrim's Guide to Origami. Oh God, origami is already with the Greek Wikipedia origami. It's never been lost. It's best work into important respects. I mean, a paper secondly provides numerous, uh, numerous band-aids to make up paper cuts or something. <laughs> Read more. Sure. For the Grand Origami Master is absolutely essential for each origami to be completed. Exactly forty-two movies. The most organized scissors cuts. Most of the tournaments scissor cuts are considered cheating, but a Uppercuts are deemed illegal. Uppercuts, huh? <laughs> That's kind of funny. Tell your girlfriend to love zombie. Yeah, read the passage. Uh, maybe another year. <laughs> you don't want to read the zombies? And first, new clothes. You know, what's up about the new clothes? And the colors, the colors are beautiful fabric. I've never seen anything like it in my life. They all try to conceal disappointment not being able to see the clothes. A child, however, who had no important role, you could only see things as I showed them to him. Went up to the carriage. But he hasn't got anything on, the child said. Don't talk nonsense, his father reprimanded with a boy's remark, which has been heard by Sanders, was repeated over and over. Yeah. Take that. Turn it off, you giant doofus. Sorry, kids. I'm just taking a peek around, okay? All right. Let's go over here. Why does even give me an option? Alright, let's go upstairs and check on old dude. See what's up. What do you say? What do you, what do you, what do you say, huh? Those two shouldn't have stayed up that late, but I should have watched them. Uh, it's not an everyday circumstance, I know, but I'm just so exhausted, I'm sure they're even more so. I need to take a seat if there's anything you want to uh, ask him. Alright. Let's get up here. And the clock doesn't tick. Wait, what time did it stop? Does it matter? Seven, eight? No, it's probably seven thirty-five. How's John doing? Barely hanging on. What are you two doing? We just, we just couldn't make any progress. 
You better be soon. We don't have long. If you're looking for your colleague, I think he's in the kitchen. Yeah, I know where he is. Because I gotta go back and talk to him again. Okay, let's slowly... Wait, there's the lighthouse pictures and... Oh, wait, these may make more sense now. So, there's the lighthouse. And this one is Penny Woman holding something yellow and blue. The last rabbit is Sir Origami. And this has a painting of three people. Would be... Him, his friend, and her, maybe? Maybe. All right, let's get back in the kitchen. You done yet? Hmm, I see, I see. I'm not sure, we'll have to check on that. Right, that part we can do. So what the heck am I supposed to do now? So, I've just been talking to this girl and asking her questions and Try, guys, I've been, I've been stuck for like the last 15 minutes walking around trying to figure it out. And so she says, Before Johnny fell unconscious, he told me that you two would probably be coming soon. He said he probably wouldn't get the chance himself, but he wanted me to tell you thanks for him. So, thank you. Okay. Let's see if this dude's off the phone yet. Am I unstuck yet? I am unstuck! Hot dog. Man, that was... That was getting pretty... Pretty... Pretty tough. Hmm. What is it? Just a big open spot. Oh, there. Seems like our little Johnny here has some hidden records from the old days. Hidden records? Hidden medical records, to be exact. Apparently, during his youth, he was administered a large dose of enhanced beta blockers. Beta blockers. And what luck, they tend to have this little side effect on curious thing called memories. Beta blockers. Johnny didn't have a heart condition, did he? Apparently not. Which leads one to wonder. If the side effects were intended to be merely just that to begin with, if the side effects were intended to be merely just that to begin with, and in such a large amount, the impact on his memories at that time of administration must have been significant. You think that's what kept us out of his earliest memories? Well, it's not the machine, I'll tell you that. The maintenance department yelled at me for scolding them. So what now? I was just given the, recon the reconfiguration frequencies. That should help us get past the blockers. And once we're in his childhood, it might finally be early enough to transfer desire f for it to work. Then what are we waiting for? Just one more thing. Of course, there's always that one thing. In order to, in order to, act in order to activate the new frequencies, we'll need a trigger. A trigger? Something that exists strongly in the bridging inaccessible memory. And we'll need to give it to John for him to stimulate some memory internally. But what do we know of that? We've only gotten a glimpse of his childhood memories. I think we found a childhood photo or something. John is un uh, John's unconscious. Yeah, back square one. You know, this job hasn't been such a pain in the butt for me since... Nora's case last year. Likewise. This is killing me. I'm going to have to get some fresh air. Ahem. Forgot my coffee. <laughs> Beta blocker. Okay. It smells! Quit barging in out of doors. The road, Kaliva. It smells! I know, it's your fault for running over it. What's going on? The children are still sleeping. 
Wait a minute. That last memory, the one we were stuck at. It was the same smell. What are you two talking about? The, the olfactory receptors are directly linked to the brain. Let me know. Do you see what this means? Um, what? It means the smell is arguably the most effective sense for memory recall. We can use it the same stimulation to uh, bridge his childhood memories. And the best part, even though Johnny is unconscious, he's still susceptible. I, I think I'm missing some vital contextual info on the whole thing. Alright, this is good. This is awesome. Now you just need to go fetch a piece of roadkill. Yes, I'll just... Wait, why should I fetch it? You're the one who just ran over it. You're the one who ran over it. Exactly. I've already done my part. Oh, you miserable jerk. Mm, if it helps any, I... I have a pair of gloves you can borrow. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. They aren't very disposable gloves, but that'll probably change after this. Okay, so I gotta have to go back and get the rope kill. Come on, game. You're really gonna make me walk all the way back to get some roadkill. Oh, you jerk. Oh, you jerk, 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 jerk. Whatever. Whatever. There they go again. Huh? Deja vu. But that has happened three times now, actually. Am I still in his mind? Just grasping the straws, really. Okay, there's the car. It's not smoking anymore. And there's the roadkill. The kind of thing this job gets me into. It's not safe just to bring a piece of German infected roadkill like this. There's a valve container in the car. A valve container, at least it make the odor controllable. Okay, good. It's not going to make me walk all the way back, I guess. Where are you going? I... I gotta take a leak. Something's up. Something's getting fishy around here. I don't know what it is. Okay, what a mess. Crash shook everything up. Let's see. What's that? Ah, oh, here it is. See, valve container. Maybe it's just some garbage I threw out. Now I get some of that dirty roadkill. What is this? This? Painkillers? Hmm. Is that what he needs to come get his painkillers? Uh, contained roadkill odor. So I guess I'll meet him on my way back. Deja vu again? Oh, hey. Did you get the roadkill? It's ready. Great! Go get it set up. I'll be right back. Neil. These painkillers. I think they are yours. Hey! May I ask why you're on them? I wasn't going to tell you, but... Oh, this is embarrassing. A few days ago, I walked into a concrete wall. You just walked into a wall like that? What can I say? I was in deep thought. You know how deeply I think. 
Those are some rather strong pills, Neil. It was a rather strong concrete wall. Well, this is a match made in heaven, I say. Anyways, you got the road kill, right? Let's hurry. John's dying back there. Neil. You weren't addicted, are you? Are you kidding me? I'd overdose before I'd sink into that level of contrived mess. Hmm. Hmm. The blood thickens. Ish. Ish. So, when we get to that exact point, I'll send the signal. When I do, I want you to release the valve for about three seconds. Certainly. It's the same doctor as before. About time he showed up. Have you made sure the germs are sealed off? Fully sealed and filtered. Not like it mattered to a dead man. You should know that Johnny's condition is deteriorating fast. This might be your last chance, you two. Whatever you do in there, good luck. Luck's the last thing we need. And we're back in the brain. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Act three. They shine their lights, the other lighthouse, and at me. Mm, okay. Act three. Game's still going. At least act two is a lot shorter than act one. Okay. So we're back here again. Let's go. He's on the ball. I think this little thing is causing us so much trouble. I just want to kick it into outer space. I suppose I can all. I suppose all we can do now is send the signal and hope. Well, ready? <coughs> Something's happening. Quick, send it again. What's going on? Doctor, something's wrong. What? Take over for me, Lily. This condition has been destabilized. Intake levels must be reconfigured. What's happening this place? It's been destabilized. Get out. What? Out of his memory now! What are you talking about? If the system doesn't reestablish soon, the shot might permanently damage whoever's in here. You've got to be kidding. You aren't. Wait, why aren't you getting out then? I can't, Neil. If both of us get out under this state, all our work will be reset. There won't be enough time to redo all we've done before Johnny. Oh, are you freaking? Don't pull that contrived crap on me. This ain't a movie, and you're no hero. You're just being a moron. Why are you being one too? Get the heck out of here. Screw that. If you're gone, then they'll probably pair me up with Alistar. You know how badly he smells? Worse than the roadkill. Dang it, Neil. This is what I get for helping you cheat through the entrance exams. They don't seem very worried about getting their brain scrambled. I think we're okay for now. It's all red. No, okay. And guess what? Your carrot cake sucks. 
Wait a minute. Yeah, and the last Christmas party, you... Oh. Come on, let's go before that happens again. Um, you know I didn't mean to, you know, call you a moron, right? You know what? You know that I did, right? Okay. So now we can walk over, maybe? No? Look, just, just walk straight. Okay, apparently I cannot go that way. Awesome. Let's go back up. Was I supposed to play with the soccer ball? Come on, this is this is kind of a really big map for me just to wander around and aimlessly. Seriously, just okay. No, it's not that bad. Maybe I missed the ball. Here you go. <laughs> Had to miss the ball. Here goes nothing. And here we are, in Childhood Land. Wow, can't believe that worked. So we actually made it. But now I'm not sure if I'm going to like this place. What do you mean? Seems peaceful enough. Neil, did you know something odd about Johnny's room earlier? Uh, what? There was something strange in there. Did you not see it? I, I suppose not. I don't remember what it was either. Never mind. I just hope I'm wrong. What was in there? Okay. Wow. That sounds fabulous. I know, right? We've got to take them there one day. Sheesh, the time overlaps, the time overlaps getting out of hand. <coughs> Excuse me. Look how many of them, look how many of him there are. It's like a zoo. Mm-hmm. There's the one with the ball. Let's go see what he's doing. There's some roadkill. Ha! Huh. Looks like the ball's moving around at its own. He's just chasing it. Hey, roadkill. What's up? All thanks to this little fella sacrificing. I hope. Or sacrifice. Maybe not ing. Sacrifice. Or. Oh, geez, look at the time. Better get going. The store closes early today. Oh, take care, Martha. Say hello to the boys for me. I will. I'll see you around. the end of the road. And you were saying? Never mind that. Maybe I was wrong after all. I mean, this place. It's so peaceful. The only thing that exists in his memory that could do such a thing would be... Crap. Duh! We need to go back now. Wait. What's going on now? Just shut up and come! That's what she said. Her his mom's gonna die. Maybe? Car wreck? Is he gonna get run over? Don't uh, yeah. play in the street with your ball, you dummy. <laughs> Bam! Got him.
understand. If he was unconscious, how could we sing this here when he never did? Still, I'm just surprised they survived. Actually, he didn't. He's a goddamn zombie. Holy crap, dropping bombs on me like that. We're pausing it right here. We're pausing it right here. I gotta go get me something to drink. <laughs> and I gotta pee. So, we'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. This is Toasty, my friends. Hello. Hello, this is Selection.